The city of El Monte, California, recently honored local 105 business representative Tim Hinson, praising his work in helping community members achieve a better life through our union. The certificate of recognition is a testament to his dedication to his community and to the principles of the labor movement. It started with my dad, you know, becoming a sheet metal worker. My dad got the person that lived caddy corner to us in the union, then the guy down the street. And we have about four generations of people that originated from that street that have become sheet metal workers. And that really inspired me to, I used to do just tutoring on that level. I would tutor people, you know, to prep for the test. Um, and then when I, after I became a business agent, I started, um, it, it, a lot of people found out that I tutor and it turned into classes. What I really truly do is I believe that the test was a hurdle. It was a hurdle for like our classified workers. So we had all these proven guys that were great for the industry and they proven themselves as good sheet metal workers, but they were unable to get a score high enough on the test to come in. So what I actually do is I really just do, I, I prep them for the uh, entrance exam and then I help them with their interviews. I, I enjoy it too. I enjoy teaching them and love hearing when they pass the test and they're in the apprenticeship and I see them at the orientation. When you, when you treat them like their family or like you would treat your nephew, I think that's where some of the big fall off is in our industry, that, that it seems very easy to us, but we may have had our dad show us that where a new person is somewhat lost. And when you just treat them like they're your nephew, and that's kind of what I do, and it, it's worked really well for me. When my dad ended up joining uh, the apprenticeship, after about one year, it was life changing. It doesn't end with in my belief with that first person, it really changes the community because now all of a sudden their kids have that opportunity. Even if the kids don't take the opportunity and become something else, that opportunity and the knowledge of what we offer is still there for them. It's really changed our lives for the better. And that's why I, I, I do what I do as far as reaching back and trying to not only create an opportunity for a person, but for their entire family moving forward. From job sites across Delaware, to rail yards in Kansas, to the classrooms in El Monte, smart members continue to lead and empower workers for better jobs in a union. Together, let's continue to create opportunities for our families, our jobs, and our future. Thank you for watching Smart News. Solidarity forever.